Hello and welcome in this video. In this video we will cover solution for two different situations for reading of multi-page forms. Situation 1. All the sheets scan together in a folder but the subforms of a single candidate are scanned collated together in sequence. Situation 2. All the sheets scan together in a folder but the subforms of all candidates are mixed up and scanned in random order. Let us consider an example of multi-page forms with all forms having different OMR designs. Our example contains total four pages, or we can say it consists of two sets of duplex forms printed back to back. The first page contains the candidate information. And the following three pages contain test questions for different sections. Page 2 section 1 has 100 questions. Page 3 section 2 has 80 questions. Page 4 section 3 has 50 questions. Now let us see if there is any special need at the stage of designing for multi-page forms. We have seen in the earlier videos how to create OMR forms using the admin OMR sheet designer. We can see here the thumbnails of our four sub forms. These four forms have been designed like any other regular design except for an additional step that we also create a master form which virtually contains all the sub forms. Now here we will just create a master form in which we do not need to place any blocks because this form will act as a virtual container for the other designs. But in the settings we will mention the design ID of the forms that this master form will contain. The IDs of the subforms must be entered in the sequence in which the result is expected. Press the merge button to automatically furnish the master form with all the required blocks. Remember this master form is just a virtual container to contain all the blocks. This master form will not be exported or printed. Now we proceed to scanning and reading of these forms. All the forms can be scanned to one folder but there can be two different ways of doing it. Let us first see the operation process for case 1 where all the forms of a single candidate are scanned collated together and in sequence. Once the files have been scanned, we move to the software. The scanned sheets for the multi-page forms have to be read in the survey and form reader module. The entire folder is selected and first the images to be processed are tagged according to multi-page sequence. Now if you see the original file names have been added with suffixes A, B, C, D to maintain their sequence of all the subforms of a single candidate. The sequence again starts with A and goes to D for the forms of next candidate. Then we shall adopt the multi-page reading option. And select the first design in the sequence. The software will automatically read each consecutive sheet as per each consecutive design. If any of the subforms for any candidate has issues, the entire multi-page set for that form will be skipped from reading in order to avoid any mismatch and mingling of pages. Once reading is done, we shall proceed to the next step to manage data. Select the master sheet design and press merge to collate the data of all four sheets into one. After merging, all data extraction and reporting can be handled in the usual admin OMR way. Here we see some outputs. Further if this is a feedback, press the button to automatically define a survey to get graphical reports.
more about survey form reports has been shown in another video in the series. If it is a multiple choice question test, define a test to process the read data. And get results like a test. Now let us consider the second case where the multi-page forms of all students are mixed up and scanned into one folder in jumbled order. Here it is important not only to identify the OMR design number to which an image corresponds but also to identify the candidate identity to which the subform belongs. To identify the design number to which the scanned page conforms to, we have to place a page sorter block, somewhere at a common location on all the designs. Since our design has four pages we place a block that can deliver four sequential values. Each page will have values marked in sequence as 1, 2, 3, 4. On fetching the image the software will use this page sorter value to auto-identify the page number and its corresponding design and read the sheets even if they are all mixed up. To identify the candidate ID or the link between the forms, it becomes important to place a block which can be used as a common link between all the subforms of one candidate. The linking field can be an OMR block in which the candidate will fill his unique ID. The link can also be a barcode, same or interrelated value printed on all four sheets or it can be a pre-printed number. In case of barcode or OCR readable number you will need to pre-print the number or barcode using the variable data printing facility in the software. But in case of OMR form ID block, you won't need to do any pre-printing. Your sheets can be common template in which the candidate will fill his own ID. In this case when we have already the identifying value on each sheet, so it is not required to tag the images using suffix for any multi-page sequencing. The page sorter block will help us identify the page number and tag the image with suitable prefix which will be used to read that particular scanned image as per corresponding design. And select the first design in the sequence and read the images in the folder. After this step the process of merging data and getting reports is same as shown in the previous case. 